I've been doing customer experience practically my entire life. I come from a very traditional Indian family who've had businesses all our lives and uh, therefore very familiar with service. In about 2012, um, as part of the old mutual insurer, back then Mutual and Federal, it helped start up the customer experience area, I got introduced to customer experience as a discipline. And I've been working in customer experience since. I recently went out onto my own and now run a company called Obsessive Customer Demeanor, or OCD, where we try and transform every business we touch into customer obsessed junkies. I think every industry you look at, customer is at the center of that industry. The industry wouldn't exist unless there was a demand, right? So it's, it's the traditional, you know, you need a demand and there's a supply for the demand. And it's the customers that actually make those industries. Um, in South Africa and most of Africa for now, I think CX is still very predominant and very, very well taken up in the financial services industry, but growing in other industries. Um, I do believe that no matter what industry you're in, if you don't put the customer at the center and at the heart of everything you do, you simply will not be able to grow your business. Um, we live in an era where things just rapidly keeps changing and it's the customer that now decides what they want, when they want and how they want. It's no longer a matter of you know our competitors are the traditional competitors. It's now new entrants into the markets followed up by guys who never used to do the same thing you do and are suddenly branching out to expand their businesses. And therefore it's very important to understand the customer across all industries and be able to understand how they show up in different industries. So I love the question. Um, I think for a very long time, most of the conferences and most of the events you go to, everything is focused so much around technology. And um, I think about two years ago at the very same conference, there was a topic where we discussed, you know, the, the dying of the CRM system versus CX. And the reason why that happened is probably because of the focus on technology. At the end of the day, no matter what technology you put together, it is a person, a human being, that's got to make that technology work. And it's the connection between the customer and the brand is made by the employee of that brand. And if you can't connect on a human level, if you can't get your employees to connect with your brand on a human level, you'll never get them to connect the customers to your brand. And that has to be done on a human level. I guess it goes um, across all industries and in any walk of life. You can either talk the talk and always spend money on getting insights, understanding what the customers need. But if you don't do something with it and you don't actually action what it is they require you to action to make the experience better, then no matter what corporate you come from, you basically just swimming upstream. And unless you can actually put together a proper action plan and execute against that action plan, you'll never actually achieve anything for your customer. You'll keep doing what old school companies have done and that's discuss things in a boardroom insist on spending money on a number of different initiatives and never ever change anything in their organizations and so we noticed that certain organizations just die a slow death. I think we need to, to pay special attention to that connectivity between technology and the human element we spoke of earlier. Um, we need to learn to use our technology to the benefit of us as people, as human beings, our employees who then create the experiences for our customers. And when we start combining those sort of technologies with the heart and the feeling of our employees and the heart and the feeling of our customers is when we start winning. Um, a very good example, for, exa for, for instance, would be if you take virtual reality or augmented reality. You can do such amazing things in that sphere if you just use the emotional connection that is created between a little child seeing something come to life on a cell phone or through virtual reality uh, glasses and bring that to your brand. And I think it's absolutely critical for us going into 29 to understand that we've got to bring the human element into technology for us to take this forward. I think events like this are absolutely great. You get to meet very, very awesome people, like-minded people. You get to meet people that want to take this as a, an industry much further and across other industries as well. And what is really good is the networking opportunities that come out of it. And uh, definitely and by far, um, there's so much to learn from the speakers that stand up and you know brave the crowd and share their wisdom with us. So outstanding work again from Kinetic and CAM.